In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to buy Gmail storage. As we continue to use Gmail for our daily communications, receiving countless emails, photos and documents, it's common to run out of the free storage space provided by Google. Luckily, acquiring more storage is a straightforward process, and I'm here to guide you through it step by step. Firstly, let's talk about the necessity of buying additional Gmail storage. Google offers 15 GB of free storage spread across Gmail, Google Drive and Google Photos for every account. For many of us, especially those who use these services for work or personal archiving, this amount is quickly consumed. When you're nearing or have reached your limit, your ability to send and receive emails will be affected, making it crucial to either clean up your space or purchase additional storage. Let's dive into the process. Begin by logging into your Gmail account. Once you're in, navigate your browser to any page. Here you'll be proceeding to look at your Gmail search bar at the top, but this is just a simple step towards finding the Google account settings where the magic happens. Now head to the top right corner of the screen and click on your profile picture. This action will reveal a drop down menu from which you'll select the manage your Google account option. Clicking this takes you directly to your Google accounts overview page where numerous settings and information about your account are displayed. Within this dashboard, you need to locate the section labeled payments and subscriptions. The naming itself is pretty self-explanatory, but if you're ever in doubt, it contains all the information related to your purchases and subscriptions within the Google ecosystem. Once you're in the payments and subscriptions section, look for an option titled account storage. Clicking on this will take you to a page that gives an overview of your current storage situation across Google services. It's also the place where you can manage your storage options. On this page, find the manage storage option and give it a click. This will lead you to another page dedicated to your storage across Google Drive, Gmail and Google Photos, showing what amount of space you're utilizing and in what ways. If you're confirming that more storage is indeed what you need, the next step is to click on the Get More Storage link. This action will direct you to Google One, which is Google's paid subscription service offering expanded storage. On the Google One page, you'll be presented with different plans and pricing. Each plan offers a set amount of storage and comes with its own benefits, including access to Google experts, the option to add family members to your plan, and more. Take your time to go through the different plans available to find one that suits your needs and budget. Once you select a plan, go through the checkout process. Google will guide you through entering your payment information and confirming your purchase. Congratulations, once you complete these steps, you've successfully bought more Gmail storage. To wrap up, buying additional storage for your Gmail account can relieve you of the stress related to managing emails and files within Google's ecosystem. Remember, it's also wise to regularly clean out unnecessary files and emails to make the most of your available storage. With your new storage capacity, you can continue to use Gmail, Google Drive and Google Photos without worrying about hitting your limit too soon. Thank you for watching this tutorial on how to buy Gmail storage. Whether you're a long-time user running out of space or someone anticipating the need for more storage down the line, I hope this guide makes the process seamless for you. Stay tuned for more helpful tips and tutorials.